everyone, welcome back to a special Mavis Mystery Mayhem episode. So in today's video, we're going to be unboxing some blind boxes that Kika Goods have gifted me. So Kika Goods is an online store that sells lots of different collectible items, blind boxes and art toys. And they've also given me a discount code to share with you guys. So you can use the code MEVU to get 10% off your order. I'll leave all the information about that in the description box if you guys want to check them out. So they have a few different social media accounts, including an Instagram and also Discord. So I'll leave all the information about them below as well. So let's have a look at the blind boxes that they sent me. So this first box is the smaller of the two boxes. This box also had some full sets of blind boxes in it as well, which I've already uploaded videos for. So if you guys want to check them out, I'll leave a link to them. But let's take the first items out. They actually started to stock some remints on their website, so I was really excited to see these. So the first blind boxes here are the Sumiko Garashi Cake Shop remints. So we have four of the remints. Let's put them over there. And then we have three more blind boxes in this first box. And this is a Pop Mart series, and it is the Azura Animal Fighting Match series. And I'm super excited to open these as well, as Azura is a super cute character. So you can see some of the designs on the side, which we'll have a closer look at in a moment. So let's move these three boxes over here, and I'll grab the larger box. Okay, so here is the larger box. Here's the first box. So this one is called Pajama Party. I think these ones might be ball jointed dolls. It has a cute little packaging design with like a wardrobe on this side. And then we have the characters on this side. That one over there. And let's grab this next box. So this next one is a Simon Toys series and this is Nini Z. I know a lot of you guys like this character series and this is the Cherry Blossom Season series. So I'm very excited to see these ones as they look like they're all pastel colored and they look super cute. Let's put this one there. Let's grab this next one. So this next series is the Moko Kimo Campus series. I haven't opened any of these before, but the designs look adorable. On the side here, we have another Nunisi Cherry Blossom Season. So we have two of those to open. Let's grab this box next. This is another Azura series, and the series is Spring Fantasy. So this one has lots of cute floral designs. So we have a few of these boxes. I can see some more in the back here. But we'll grab those in a moment. This next one is the Roll Life Nancy Stream series. I opened two of these blind boxes in a previous video and the designs were super cool. So I'm looking forward to opening this one. Hopefully we can get a different design. That one over there. Let's grab this box next. So this next blind box is a series I haven't opened up before, but I've seen a few pictures of it online and it's called Sank the Child. And the outside of the box kind of looks like a suitcase that has like the little wheels on the bottom here, which looks quite cool. Back. And there's the designs. So we'll have a closer look at those. This next box is a larger one and it's a plushy buying box. And this is the Chino's Law series. So these ones are little plushies and they kind of look like dragons. Can't wait to open this one. Let's grab this box next. So this next one is the Uli Uli series by Finding Unicorn. And these ones are little capsules that have mini figures inside. So these ones feature a range of different Finding Unicorn characters. This next series is a Miko illustration series. And I saw lots of pictures of these online and thought they were really, really cute. So we have some different like animal characters. That one there. Let's grab this next box. So we have another Moko Kimo box. So we have two of those to open. And then this next one, I think this is another Miko illustrations box. So it'll be fun to see which characters are in this one. And then these other ones look like we have some duplicates of the other series. So we have two more Spring Fantasy series. So we'll be opening three in today's unboxing. And then we also have one more ball jointed doll blind box, which is the Pajama Party series. So let's put all these blind boxes together. So here are all the blind boxes that I'm going to be opening in today's video. There are 22 in total, so let's open up the first one. So this first blind box is the Miko Illustrations box. So let's have a closer look at the designs. So here are the character designs. We have two designs of mousse, and then we have two latte designs. We have two souffle designs and two cami designs. And there's also a secret. So from this series, I really like Moose, who has the pink bows. I also like Souffle, who's holding a little teddy bear. And then also the Souffle that's holding a little lemon. We have a tear tab on the top here. And let's 
take the blind bag out. And let's see who it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, we got souffle, and it's the one holding the little teddy bear. Oh my gosh, this one is adorable. So souffle has a little yellow bow in their hair, and then they're holding a little teddy bear, which has some like hair and little eyes and mouth. And it's not like printed on, it's like little pieces of the material, which is quite cool. And then on the back it says Miko Illustrations. Let's see, this one also comes with a card. So we have this cute design and has shiny silver sparkles on it. And there's the back. Let's open up the Mokokimo Campus series next. So these ones are cat themed figures and I think they're all like subject themed. So it looks like we have nine different designs and then there's also two hidden designs. So from this series, I like the photographer one here. I also like the bug catching one. Also the music one here looks super cute and the cheerleading one as well. So let's open up this box. It has the logo on the top there as well. Take the spine bag out. So this one's in a pink bag with some little paw prints. It's the same on the other side. Let's open this one. And let's see what this is. And oh, this is like a science themed one. Oh, this one is so cute and super detailed as well. So she has like a little test tube in her hand. So she has little sparkles in her eyes. And then also the back of her t-shirt says H2O. So let's grab the card for this one. There's the little card. So this one, oh, it actually looks like a little ID badge. So this one is student number eight and it says Mokokimo Campus Series. It has a little picture there. And there's the back. Next up, we have the Sumiko Garashi Cake Shop Remint. Let's have a look at these designs. So there are eight designs in this series and the designs are Welcome, Which One Should I Choose, Showcase, Special Cake, you also have Miniko Cookie, Delicious Sweets, Petit Gâteau and Souvenir. So from this series, I like the Welcome design as it has a cute little Shirokuma strawberry cake. I also like the Showcase one as it actually comes with like a display case which I think would be quite cool. This special cake one is also adorable as it's like a little birthday cake and comes with the packaging. But I also like the Miniko cookie as this one has Zasso in it and it also comes with that display case. So I'm hoping I can get one of those ones. So let's open up this box. Let's see which design it is. And oh, it's one of the display case ones. And I don't know which one it is yet. Oh my gosh, I think it's the Miniko one. I think I saw Zasso there. Oh, and no, it's not. It's actually, I saw the green of Penguin. So it's not the mini coat one. It's the showcase one. So we have this little penguin cake. And then who's in this one? It looks like this one is just a little, oh, it's the little bag. So here's the little penguin cake. This one is a really detailed. It even has like the texture on the bottom. And then we have this other little cake. It has like a cookie version of the little bag which matches the like the white dots of the cake and oh you can even see like the biscuit part on the bottom that is so cool and then this one also comes with a little information booklet so this one is number three and it comes with like a little cut out display i think so these ones are little like cake coasters and then it comes with a catalog so you can cut this out and then fold it into the sheet of paper here and then it also shows you how you can display more of the different cakes in the case. So let's take this case out of the packaging. So it says Sumiko Garashi Cake Shop on the front there. There's the other sides and then it's open at the back. So we can put the little cakes in like that. And then you can set up a little display. So I'm glad that Kikagood sent me a few of these so I can add the other little cakes into this showcase as well. So let's open up the next item. This next blind box is the Pop Mart and Azura Spring Fantasy series. Let's have a closer look at the designs. So in this series there are 12 designs and then also one secret. So the regular editions have a ratio of 1 in 12 and the secret edition is 1 in 144. So the designs are Spring Rain, Swallow Fairy, Thawing Snow, Strawberry Fairy, Germinating, 
Thou Fairy, Coming to Earth, Catkin Fairy, White Tiger Guardian, Dew Fairy, Musk Fairy, Melting River, and then The Secret. From this series, I like the Spring Rain design. I also like the Strawberry Fairy and the Flower Fairy. And the Thawing Snow one looks really cool as well. So I'm hoping I can get one of those, but I'd also really love to see what the Secret Edition looks like. So let's open up this box. I love how colourful this series is. The box is really, really pretty. Let's open up the tear tap here. And see what it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, this one is the Catkin Fairy, I think. Oh, this one is adorable. So it's in like a yellow and like sort of brown beige kind of theme. Oh, and it even has like a little cape on the back. It has like lots of different textures. Like the hair is this like matte kind of finish. But this part here, it's like, it's a little bit transparent, but it feels different to the rest of the figure. And she even has like a little sparkle bit on her hair here. And also another one here. This one also comes with a stand. So it looks like she's standing on like a little cloud. Also has a little sparkle there and says Pop Mart and Azura on the bottom. So let's put her standing onto this one. So there is the little figure. And let's grab the card. You'll see these ones are horizontal cards. So this one is the Catkin Fairy. Let's open up another Azura blind box. This one is the Animal Fighting Match series. And we have the bunny water fight champion on the front there. So let's have a look at the other designs. So here are the rest of the designs. They are fighting match fan, fox cheerleader, kitten soldier, sheep nurse, black swan sniper, butterfly sergeant, fawn prophet, little bear reporter, mouse laser warrior, scorpion girl fight, piggy sheriff, and then a secret. So from this series, I like the little bear reporter. I also like the Butterfly Sergeant and the Kitten Soldier and then also the Bunny Water Fight Champion on the front there. Let's open this box. This is ready one, two, three. Which one is this? This is the Fighting Match Fan and she is coloured in like pastel, orange and purple. She's super cute. I love this little heart hair clip that she has. She has some more clips in her hair here as well. And she also has these really cute little pastel yellow bows on her shoes. So it looks like she's holding onto something. So let's grab the other items out of the box here. So she also comes with a stand. And it looks like she's holding like a little light stick, which is super cute. She has two little light sticks. So I think she holds the star one in her right hand. So you can put that one into her hand like that. And then she holds the other little light stick in her other hand. So here she is holding on to both light sticks. I really love these like mini designs. They're super cute. And she also comes with a little stand. So this one says Azura on the front and it has an orange base. There she is standing on the base and let's grab the card. So this is the fighting match fan. Let's open up another Remint blind box. So I'm still hoping I can get the welcome design, the special cake design or the mini co cookie. Let's open this. which design it is and oh it looks like this one is a box and oh yes it's the uh, special cake design so it's like the birthday one this one is super cute let's open that up so it's a little table that you put together that has the smoothie garashi characters on it and then these are parts of the cake so we'll take these out some really tiny pieces. Some more here. And a cake. 
Um, it looks like this is a little tin. I think there must be some stickers to add to it. Here is the cake. There's these little strawberries and like pink icing on it. That's super cute. So it looks like these pieces sit into the cake. So let's see who's sitting in these ones. We have the main Sumiko Gadashi characters. So we have Penguin. The next one is Neko. Then we have Tonkatsu. And then Shirokuma. And the last little figure is Tokage. So he sits in like that. That is adorable. And even the bottom is like textured as well. And then we have some more pieces in here. Let's take these out. So it looks like this one is the little sticker. So I think this one goes onto the tin. Let's peel that off. And then we can place this on here. even has like a little fake barcode on the back it's so detailed and then we have the little cake box so we can fold this one together as well so these fold together like this and place these parts on the side and there's the little box all put together you could probably try and fit the cake in here, but I think the top might be a little bit too large. So we can put the cake onto the tray there. So this one is the special cake. And then for this one, you can cut out the little member card here. And also this like paper cut out. Next up, we have the Nini Z Cherry Blossom Season. Let's have a look at the designs. So in this series, there are eight designs and one secret. And the secret has a rarity of one in 96. And then the rest of the designs are super pretty pastel colours. So from this series, I like the one that's holding the little bouquet of flowers. I also like this one with the umbrella and then the singer here. Let's open up the box. And let's see which design it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, this one is pink and white. And I think this one is the waitress design. Oh, she is super cute. Oh my gosh. Her hair is in this really like shiny pearl paint. She has some little bows on her hair here. And she's wearing a super cute pink dress. She also uses some of the same pearl paint. And same with her socks as well. She has a larger bow on the back of her dress. So she also comes with a stand. So we have this pastel pink stand that says Nini Z and Simon Toys. So she fits onto the stand like that. Her eye details are really pretty as well. She has like pink and blue and orange in them. Let's put her there. And let's grab the card for this one. Oh, it's actually like a cherry blossom petal. That's super cute. So we have this design here. And then it looks like there's a second card in here as well, which I think is like the series card. Next up, let's open another Spring Fantasy blind box. So I'd still like to see Spring Rain, Strawberry Fairy or Flower Fairy. And which one is this? I think it's the Swallow Fairy. Oh my gosh, yes it is. So this one is themed after a little bird. She has really pretty like shiny blue hair that kind of looks like it has like a little bit of glitter in it. And she has these little sparkles and a cute little hat as well. And she has these pretty like detailed wings on the back. And then, oh, she has like a little flower. So her stand is a little flower. That is so cute. So there she is all put together. Super cute. I really love the flower stand for this one. And let's grab the card. So she's the Swallow Fairy. Next up we have this blind box and this one is called Pajama Party. There's some cute artwork on the side. Let's have a closer look at the designs. So it says welcome to the pajama party on the top there. And there are six designs in this series. 
and from this series I really like this star design here. I also like the rabbit and the panda designs, so I'm hoping I can get one of those three. So let's open this one. And I'm not sure if there's a blind bag inside, so let's see. Oh, it doesn't look like there is. And oh my gosh, yes, it's the star design. So here's the little outfit. And then, oh, it looks like the doll is in a blind bag. So we kind of already know which one it is from the outfit. So let's take some out of the packaging. So here is the doll's face. So she has orange eyes and like yellow blonde hair. So I think on the website, they're not actually described as ball jointed dolls. I think they're more like posable figures. As you can see, like it has some like articulation in the elbow and the shoulder here, and then also at the knees and the feet. So let's have a look at the outfit pieces here. This one comes with these little socks that have stars on them, the little shorts with Velcro on them. And then I'm not sure if this is meant to be part of the shirt. And then we have the little star hat. This one is so cute and it's super soft as well. So let's put the outfit on this one. So here is the figure with the outfit on. I'm not actually sure if this is meant to be like a top or more like a scarf, as you can kind of see in the picture here. My favorite part is definitely the star hat here. I think this looks super cute. So it was kind of hard to get this one over the figure's head, but the head does come off. I'm not sure if it's meant to come off that easily, but it's pretty easy to put back on. So it's back on like that. This one also comes with a card. Let's grab this one. So, oh, it's kind of like designed like a ticket. This is super cute. So we have the design on the front there. So I just realized that this one actually is meant to be like a dress. So it has the straps on the inside. So let me redo the outfit. So I redid the outfit with the straps on it and you can kind of see the little scarf underneath here. So if you adjust the star a little bit, you can see the scarf underneath. So let's open up the next blind box. Next up, we have the second Moko Kimo Campus Series blind box. So I'm still hoping I can see the bug catching one here, the photographer, the cheerleader, or the music one here. Let's open up this box. And let's see who it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, this one is a little blue themed one. Which one is this? I'm not sure which design this is yet, so let's grab the extras and oh this one. Oh my gosh, I think this one is like the hidden one. As this is a little telescope. Oh my gosh, I think I got the rare one. That's super lucky. So this one comes with a little telescope, but it looks like the little peg here has fallen off, but I'll probably have to glue that one back together. But it has a cute little paw prints on the side here. And this figure is in blue and purple and has little planet designs on the top there. And let's grab the card for this one. So here's the little student ID. So this one is number 10. Let's open up the Sank the Child blind box next. So it looks like there's some different like rare ones on the side here. And then here are the other designs. So there are nine different designs on the side here. I like this one that's playing the guitar. And then also the one that's traveling. I think that's super cute as this box is like themed like a suitcase as well. So I'm hoping I can get one of those two or maybe one of these secret ones on the side. So on the top here, it says on the way. Which design it is. And this one's riding a little scooter. So this one is in like bright orange and blue and yellow and the jacket here is that shiny pearl paint and the scooter is in bright orange and it has a little star on the back here. We have the extra piece that goes into the helmet there and then the stand says sank on it. So we can put that one on like that. And then here's the card which says on the journey. Let's open up another Azura Animal Fighting Match series. Ready, one, two, three. This one is the Black Swan Sniper. I really love the dress here. It's in like a semi-transparent 
material and the same with the wings as well. So let's grab the stand for this one. So there she is on the stand. And let's grab this card. So this one is the Black Swan Sniper. Let's open up this Miko Illustrations box next. So I already got one of my favourites which was the souffle design. So still hoping I can get mousse or maybe the souffle with the lemon here. This artwork on the top is adorable as well. Ready, one, two, three. This one is latte. And oh, it's latte with a little strawberry. Oh, this design is actually really cute. So it has the Mika illustrations on the back and a little blue bow. And has little hearts on the feet there. Oh, this one is actually super cute. I'm also really happy with this design. Let's put the one there. And let's have the car. It says latte. And on the back it has little strawberries. That's such a cute detail. Let me have a look at the other card. So this other card had like different candy on the back. I like the different designs for these cards. They're super cute. Let's open up the third Remint box next. In this unboxing, I got the showcase and the special cake. So I got one of my favorite designs. So still hoping to either get the welcome design here or the mini co cookie design. Let's open this one. And let's see what it is. And oh, it has a little bag. So I think this one is the number eight, which is the souvenir. This one actually looks really cute. We have more little pastry items, which will look really cute. Oh my gosh, they're like little macarons for the cats. And we have some little packaging designs as well. So let's open this up. I'm really glad that I got the case in one of the boxes as that can like hold all the little items. So we have some little cakes here. Oh my gosh, these are so detailed and they're like textured as well. And it's like a little like berry type of cake. And then we have three little like macarons. And these are the three little cats. And then we have some cutlery. So we have a tiny pastel yellow fork. And then these tongs, they're in like a gold kind of like pearl paint. And then we have some little boxes. So it looks like we need to glue some of this. The box has like really cute little printed details of the little macarons. I love how everything for Riemann is so detailed. Here's the other side. And then we have this little paper bag. So you can also fold this one out. Let's also put this little box together. So I'm going to use this little tape glue on the sides here. And then these parts are meant to fold in. And then I'll press them together so the glue sticks. And then the edges fold over like that. And then there's the top of the box. So I think you can probably put the little macarons in this one. Oh my gosh, they're so tiny. The little macarons in there. So this one is number eight and the name is Souvenir. And for this one it looks like they might be little posters. So there's a receipt, a message card and then a poster that you can also cut out. Let's open up the last Spring Fantasy blind box next. So I'd still like to get Spring Rain, Strawberry Fairy or Flower Fairy. See who it is ready one two three which one is this oh this one is super pretty i can't remember which design this is so this one's name is germinating and it has a super cute pastel color design and these pretty like sleeves on the side here and then this one comes with a little stand as well so the figure fits onto it like that that is such a cute little design i love the pastel colors next up we have the uli uli series by finding unicorn these ones are kind of designed like little gachapon capsules and they have little mini figures inside. So let's grab the tear tab, which is on the side here. So we have a little card on the top here. Let's see who this first one is. 
and oh yes it's baby ghost bear i didn't get this design in my previous unboxing so super happy with that ow that actually really hurt <laughs> so here's the little baby ghost bear these ones are for like different like seasons or festivals so this one i think is for halloween let's grab the next one and let's see who it is and oh it's melinta and i don't think i have this one yet either let's take this one out of the packaging so i'm not sure which festival this one's for so if you know let me know in the comments let's grab the next one let's see who it is and oh this one is rico and i don't think i got rico last time either so this has been quite lucky So here's the little Rico figure. And then the last one, let's see who it is. And oh, this is Repola. So I didn't get any doubles. That is super lucky. Here's the Repola figure. And this one is for Christmas. Next up, let's open the second Pajama Party blind box. So since I already got the star design, I'm hoping I can get the panda or the rabbit. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can take the blind bag out first, or maybe I can. The clothing isn't on the top for this one. Let's open this and see which design it is. And oh, this one has black hair. I think it might be the panda. Oh my gosh, yes, it is. Oh, this one is adorable. So this design has black glasses and they have black eyes with little hearts inside. I really love the faces on these. So let's grab the outfit. So this one comes with a little panda jacket and the inside is even like lined that's really really nice it has little like, embroidered paws on the side and a zipper does this actually work oh my gosh it's a working zipper that is so cool so you can actually use it that's actually a really nice quality piece you could definitely like reuse this for some other dolls that might be this sort of size this one's like a little pink and black dress and then we have the little slippers or shoes so let's put the outfit on this one. So I took the head off this one as well to make it a little bit easier to put the outfit on. This one is super cute. So let's put the head back on here. So it fits on back like that. It has the little panda eyes embroidered on there. So there she is with the jacket zipped up. This one is so cute. It even has like a little panda tail here as well. Let's see if she can sort of like sit by herself. So you can sit the doll there and let's grab the card. So here is the front of the card and then here's the back with the outfit pieces. Let's open up the last Azura blind box. So still hoping to get this one on the front here. Let's open this. This one is the scorpion girl fight and oh my gosh the paint on her pants and the top are like in this shiny metallic purple that looks really really cool and she's wearing like little boxing gloves and she has these pretty like glasses with the yellow like trim on the outside she looks super cool oh she comes with like a little scorpion tail but it's kind of it looks like it's like a mechanical kind of design that's really cool this one's also in like blue and purple. So this one fits onto the back like that. That is a really, really cool design. And let's also grab the stand. I really love the metallic paint for use for this one. And let's grab this card. So this one is the Scorpion Girl Fight. So we have four more blind boxes left to go. Let's open up the second Nini Z Cherry Blossom Season box next. So I'd still like to get the tulip design, the design with the umbrella, or the singer here. Feels like there's some items on the top. I have a feeling that might be the umbrella, but let's take it out, put it behind the box. I can't see what it is yet. And let's grab the blind bag. It's the umbrella design and oh, let's see oh I think it might be oh my gosh yes it is so it's the design that's on the front of the box here oh she is so pretty so she has this really pretty pastel dress that has blue and purple in it 
and then also this little pink bow and her hair has these little like pastel flower details in them some more on the top here and she has little pink shoes so yes it was the umbrella yay so oh it's like semi-transparent and oh it even comes with like the little frame on the inside and then the same like little flower patterns that are in her hair is the other part of the umbrella so the stick goes through her hand like that that is such a cute design and let's grab the little stand here so there she is on the stand so we have the series card and then the cherry blossom petal card so we have three more blind boxes left to go let's open up the roll life nancy's dream series next and this series are 12 designs and a hidden edition and the designs are hug me funny joker counting sheep bubble bath dreamy mirror dreamy sofa dreamland fairy nightmare fairy moth butterfly specimen sleepwalk and sweet dream which is the secret and it looks like the secret one has a rarity of 1 in 144. From this one, I'd like to get the Dreamy Sofa design, or the Dreamland Fairy, or the secret. So let's open this box. is ready one two three and oh this is the butterfly specimen oh this one is so pretty and oh my gosh it's like a little picture frame so it actually has the back here which you can like move the stand so it can actually stand up that is such a cool design so the outside of the frame is in this really really pretty like purple metallic color and then we have the figure here, which has these really pretty butterfly wings. She also has little butterflies on her leg there. And then her hair is in like the pearl paint. That is such a unique design. I really love that it's like a little mini frame. So let's grab the card for this one. So this one is the butterfly specimen. So let's open up the next blind box. So we have two more boxes left to go. We have the Chino's Law blind box here and the Sumikogarashi cake shop. So let's open up the Remint first. So from this series we got the Showcase, Special Cake, and then the Souvenir Design. So still hoping to get the Miniko Cookie or the Welcome Design. Let's open this one. It's kind of like something's rattling in it. Let's see which one it is. And ooh, which one is this? I can't remember. Oh, I think this one is the Little Petite Cakes. So we have this little tray and that was the little rattling noise, it was this moving around. And also some little tongs in gold metallic paint. And then we have the little mini cakes. Oh, you can have like a little tapioca cake as well. So we have Neko and then Tonkatsu, Penguin, Tokage. We have a pink tapioca. I really love the tapioca characters as well. And then Shirokuma. And then we have a, another little box. So it looks like this one, you need to glue the sides as well. So let's put this one together. So I folded the little pieces and put some glue on the side there. So I think this part's meant to stick to this part here. And then we can fold over this part of the box. So here's the box all put together. And then we can put the little cakes inside. And then they can also sit on the little tray here. So this one is number seven. And this one, it looks like it's a little paper bag that you can cut out and glue together. And now onto the last blind box for today's video. We have the Chino's Law blind box. This one is a plushy blind box. We have the designs on the side. And the designs are white, shine, pink ball, dream, cool, crying, and then the secret. For this one, I'd like to get the shine design pink ball or dream so let's open this one let's open this tear tab and let's grab the blind bag so we have 
this pastel yellow bag. It says timeshare on the front and the back. Let's open this. Let's see which design it is. Oh, it's the dark blue one, which is the crying design. And oh my gosh, this one is so cute. So I think there might be like a little bit of wire inside the arms so you can move them around a little bit to pose them. It has the little feet there which can move. And then on the back, it has the little wings and the tail. This one is also super soft and it has the timeshare tag on the bottom. So this one has the little teardrop on the side here and it has like little eyebrows and then also these like plastic horns on the top. So let's grab the card for this one. So here's the card. So it says Chino's Law and Crying. And there's the back. So those were all the blind boxes for today's unboxing. It's so hard to pick a favourite as there were so many great designs today, but I am super happy that I ended up getting the Nini C figure with the umbrella. Let me know in the comments which blind box was your favourite, and if you guys want to check out Kika Goods, I'll leave all the information about my discount code in the description box. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!